Here are the starters. Number one, Never Jamie Sue, trained and driven by Doug Graham for the Lakeview Lawrence Stable of Laura. Two, Queen Jackie is owned by Enlow Management Incorporated of Keville, Kentucky, trained and driven by David Dameron. Number three, Ole Irma, owned by Earl Avenetti Jr., by his wife Lisa, and by their son Ryan Avenetti, all of Chrisman, trained by Lisa Earl Jr. in the bike. Number four, Miss Bewitched, owned by Jerry and Helen Logan of Springfield. Jerry is the trainer driver. Number five, Silent Wings, owned by John and Sean Nessa of Altamont and DuCoin, Illinois. Owned also by Forrest Shoemaker of Altamont and owned by Tennessee's John Boyer. John Nessa trains and Dale Heitman, the driver. Six, Swiss Jade, owned by Mary Lee Jeffers of Flat Rock, trained and driven by John David Finn. Seven, Margie Giggles, owned by Bill and Marta Alanya of Seymour, trained and driven by Bill Alanya. And number eight, Lone Hill St. Teresa. Owned by Richard and Ann McKibben of Anawan, Illinois. Trained by Dick McKibben. The driver is Tony Morgan. Post time for the third race is three minutes away. Less than three minutes to post. Is also in this race. Both of those fillies winning that stake race at Balmoral Park. Here they come. They're off and trotting. Lone Hill St. Teresa is off stride. There goes Ole Irma out for the early lead. Never Jamie Sue is right there with her toward the inside. Silent Wings gets out trotting third in the center of the racetrack. Swiss Jade is on a break. And Lone Hill St. Teresa is still off stride. One of the favorites in this race, and she drops out to the back of the pack. And there goes Ole Irma trotting up to get the lead just before the quarter. Silent Wings parks second by a neck. Never Jamie Sue goes third. Miss Bewitched is fourth. Opening quarter, 29 and 3. Queen Jackie is trotting fifth against the rail. Margie Giggles is sixth. A long way back to Swiss Jade. Further back still to Lone Hill St. Teresa. And there goes Silent Wings. And Silent Wings was parked for the first three eights, but now she's made the top by a length and a half. Ole Irma goes second down the backside. Miss Bewitched moving up third, two lengths off the lead. Never Jamie Sue is next to the inside of Queen Jackie. And then Margie Giggles at the half. Swiss Jade is 10 lengths off the lead. Lone Hill St. Teresa, another 20 lengths behind her. They got the half in 59 and 4. Miss Bewitched up alongside of Silent Wings. They're matching strides on the turn. Ole Irma third right in behind that pair. But Queen Jackie has her pinned down toward the inside midway on the final turn. Then never Jamie Sue. Margie Giggles takes to the inside. Four lengths off the lead. And they're at the three quarter. And it is Silent Wings and Miss Bewitched matching strides. Ole Irma locked in tight. Avenetti looking all over the place for an open lane. He can't find one. Queen Jackie about to set sail three wide off the three quarters and one thirty and four fifths. Margie Giggles angles out further still toward the center of the track. But Silent Wings has withstood every challenge and she opens up by two. Old Irma still looking for room. Miss Bewitched is there in third. Silent Wings by two lengths in the final sixteenth. Old Irma not getting the job done. Silent Wings too much. Margie Giggles coming late. Silent Wings. Silent Wings gets it. Silent Wings by three. Ole Irma hung on for a second by a neck over that fast closing Margie Giggles in one fifty nine and three. Returning after picking up that win in her elimination of the Illinois State Fair Colt Stakes for trotting three-year-old fillies. On by John Nessa of Altamont, Sean Nessa of DuCoin, Forrest Shoemaker of Altamont, John Boyer of Memphis, Tennessee. Trained by John Nessa, giving him a perfect two for two at the 2000 Illinois State Fair, having won yesterday's final race with Valboski as trainer and owner. And today, a Nessa trained trotting filly, Silent Wings, keeps his record perfect. And into the winner's circle with Dale Heitman driving. Here she is, Silent Wings and Heitman. Silent Wings, joined by the entourage of owners. Force Virginia Shoemaker are there, along with his son, Ken. The Boyers, Mrs. Boyer being John Nessa's daughter, Sean Nessa's sister. So it's a family affair, Mrs. Sean Nessa and family. All the grandkids are there. One they bred has won the second elimination, so that's an interesting situation. And now down to Kurt Becker with Sean Nessa. 
All right, thank you, Carl. We are with Sean Nessa. Sean, we talked to you yesterday after the last race when your stable won with Valboski, you and your father. Today, Silent Wings. This filly has not raced since July 4th until today. Why? Well, uh, she was really wasn't no races for her, and we didn't want to put her any overnights in Chicago, so we just uh, laid her off a little bit, trained her up easy, and then uh, last week put a pretty stiff trip into her and just kept her fresh, and I thought that would be the best way to go with her. Tell you what, the strategy's been justified. She comes home a winner. You got some more to race. We'll let you get going. Congratulations. Thanks, Kurt. That's Sean Nessa, ladies and gentlemen. Back to Carl Becker.